What's up everybody, Oliver here for iInfluence and I'm gonna be moving pretty quick through this video so you're gonna to have to keep up, all right? I'm gonna be giving you the best, but at the same time, the shortest possible explanation that I can on the difference between computer glasses and blue light filtering glasses. And let's just keep this party rolling. Let's jump into this with blue light filtering glasses. Blue light filtering glasses are just like the name says. All they do is filter blue light. They typically will target between 380 and 450 nanometers. It could go a bit higher, let's say up to 500, if that set of glasses is going to be used primarily, let's say, to not disrupt your sleeping transition from wake to sleep. Let's not get too much into the details, but that's why you're gonna find a variety of different blue light filtering glasses with different color lenses. They're targeting a different part of the light spectrum, okay? But at the end of the day, they're really just filtering out blue light. That's what they're doing. And they could do it in two ways. The first and my favorite way of doing it is with a built-in filter. So the blue light is being filtered through the lens, okay? So the lens is absorbing it. They put it into the polymer. They put it into that resin. They put it into the material itself. So that is what a set of blue light filtering glasses does. Uh, on their first way of filtering out blue light is with a built-in blue light filter. The second way is with a coating on the front surface of the lens. And though I started off by saying that they filter it, the truth is they bounce it, okay? So they bounce blue light off of the front surface of the lens using what they will call an anti-reflective coating. But the truth is it's more of a reflective coating, not anti-reflective coating. Because if you could see the pink, blue, or purplish hue on the front surface of that lens, it's because that's what is bouncing off. So you're aware of it, you can see it. It's creating a reflection. It's reflecting off blue light. And that's why it's not my favorite choice because you could see it. And I don't like that. I don't like my lenses to look pink or purple or blue because I could see it on my side also, as well as somebody looking at me. That's not my favorite way of doing it, but that is one way that people are able to block blue light. But blue light filtering glasses simply do that. They only filter blue light. They don't do anything else, okay? They're not gonna help reduce the symptoms of digital eye strain like a lot of manufacturers would lead you to believe. They don't do it unless they have power in the lenses. Now, this is where we will transition into computer glasses, okay? So computer glasses, for those of us that are in the eye care industry, I'm an optician been an optician for over 15 years. I work with ophthalmologists, work with optometrists, and I've helped thousands of patients over the course of my career. And computer glasses are lenses that have power in them, which are intended to help the wearer focus on something that is about 24 inches, roughly 24 inches or closer. The power that's in the lens provides a focal length. So the doctor, the eye doctor that this person sees is able to write a prescription for a specific distance. Now, not everyone needs prescription, okay? But we're not gonna touch on that. We're just, once again, talking about the difference here. So a set of computer glasses will have power in the lens, which helps people to remain focused on something that is about 24 inches or closer. And then when we look at something that's up close, our pupils slightly converge. They just come together ever so slightly, okay? Take this for example. Here's my thumb. Look at my eyes, not my thumb, okay? I'm gonna look at my thumb. You look right here, okay? So as I look at my thumb, and I'm gonna bring it closer, look what happens to my eyes. Right? Did you notice that? You see how my eyes converge? They slightly came together, right? The closer it is, the more cross-eyed we become. Well, imagine if you're looking at something that's about yay far or about 24 inches. Very slight, you can't even tell that my eyes are coming together, but they are. Keeping it in that position causes a lot of strain on our eyes. The power that we put in the lenses and by putting the optical center slightly closer together, which this is measured by an optician, uh, it's called a near PD, by putting the optical center in the near PD, our eyes are gonna be encouraged to look through that part of the lens which is gonna help your eyes to relax when you're looking at a computer screen, tablet, smartphone, reading a book, doing all sorts of things that are up close or considered to be mid-range or near. But you can only do that when there's power in the lens. You can't do that when it's simply filtering out blue light. Computer glasses 
may not even have a blue light filter, but they're more of a true set of computer glasses because it's helping to reduce the strain and fatigue which is caused from just looking at a digital device all day. So that is a set of computer glasses compared to a blue light filtering glasses. One has power, which is helping your eyes to remain focused and reducing the strain and fatigue on your eye muscles and could also help to prevent digital eye strain. You still need to take breaks. Don't, don't think that just because you have computer glasses you don't need to rest your eyes. You definitely do. Blue light filtering glasses, on the other hand, will only filter blue light. Those are ideal for helping you to maintain your circadian rhythm. They're ideal for, let's say, those late night computer sessions or gaming sessions. That's when you want to wear a set of blue light filtering glasses. Yes, you can have something that has both. Okay, then you would have a set of blue light filtering computer glasses. When you have a blue light filter and power in the lenses together, making everyone that much better. That is, in essence, the difference between blue light filtering glasses and computer glasses. Power is the difference. <laughs> All right, if you have any questions, leave it in the comment section below. I have a video much longer where I go into a little bit more detail. I'll leave it somewhere on the side here of this video so that you could click on it if you want a little bit more detail. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Oliver Fry Influence. Have an awesome day.